And so, without further ado, let's hear their voices. Well then, I'm gonna report you to the superintendent. I'm gonna show you a pressure cooker like you've never seen, you, you crock pot. Well, how's it feel? Are you cool now? Are you part of the in crowd? Are you with it? Or do you feel like a dirty, backstabbing liar? What do you mean I'm suspended? This is so unfair. Ugh. Should've just blown up your ugly Volkswagen instead. Welcome to the Blue Devil Update. This is a script. This is an Emma. I'm an Ian. And this is a Blue Devil Update episode. Next week is College Application Week. Yikes, let's find out more about that. Coming up next week is going to be College Application Week, so we're going to be doing tons of programming to help you guys get applied to college. We're going to be in the Media Center all week, um, so you can drop in, ask some questions, fill out your FAFSA, file um, your residency, and fill out an application. Um, and on Tuesday, the 16th, at 6.30 at the Citizen Center, we're going to be having financial aid night. Um, so come, bring your parents. Um, we're going to be going over everything you need to know about paying for college. Recycling is an easy way for you to do something for your environment. But there are some basic rules you need to follow. Let's hear about that. Okay, so at Mooresville we do recycling. Um, there are small blue bins in your teacher's classrooms. I want you to know that it actually gets recycled. I just want to make sure that you are not throwing any liquids and um, or food. When I pick up the thing and then yes, there's liquid going nasty. down my arm. No, no. For this week's teacher spotlight, we will pop in with the teacher of the month. Check it out! So I'm here in the band room and we're about to surprise our October Teacher of the Month, Mr. Stevenson. So, Ms. Smith, will you get Mr. Stevenson for me? It's not good. I'm Come here. Am I in trouble or something? Over. <laughs> All right, let's give it up for Mr. Stevenson. <laughs> ROTC drill team took first place overall at the St. Stephen's drill meet on Saturday. They were awarded first place in color guard, armed squad, first year squad, personnel inspection, first year color guard, and unarmed squad. Congratulations! Also, congratulations to the Morrisville Pride in Motion marching band on receiving the following awards at the North Lincoln Round Table Tournament of Bands on Saturday. First place for 4A in music, marching, general effect, drum major, percussion, color guard, and band. Fourth place overall out of 14 bands. I'm Zoe. I'm Luke. I'm both fun. And this is the Student Spotlight. So how was the Special Olympics, you guys? It was it really was fun, actually. Fun. A lot of fun. Like, what different activities did y'all do there? We did, uh... We did the kickball. We did kickball. There. Soccer. Soccer. Soccer skills. We had a fun did. time, yeah. It was hot. Mm-hmm. You did tell me. Now to the highlights. I've been hearing that things have been happening all over our campus, and I want to hear about those things. Let's check it out. So in Art One right now, we are doing a thing called Inktober. Every day we have a new prompt, kind of like a warm up, but also not really. I'm not sure how to describe it. But every day we have a new word, like the first day it was poisonous, tranquil. Today it was flowy, 
So, you know, people would draw a waterfall for Chloe, poisonous, maybe a snake or a poison bottle. And it's been really fun. Hi, I'm Bobby Lowry. I went on an engineering field trip last Friday to Ingersoll Rand, and they um, they produce air compressors, golf carts, and a bunch of other stuff like that. And they gave us a tour of their facilities and uh, and showed us in depth what they do and what they build and their manufacturing processes. So we've been on the waiting list for five years. We have for three weeks, um, so we're trying to use them as much as we can to um, give the kids experience of using professional level markers uh, that they use in industry for graphic arts, for illustration, for um, interior design. So Teen Marine Week is basically a celebration of um, reading. These are the big prizes. There's still ways for you to get involved on campus. And here is just one of the gorgeous clubs available to you gorgeous people. Hey, my name is Calvin, and I'm a member of the American Sign Language Club. If you want to learn an important skill that you can use later in life, come to Ms. Hocutt's room, room A315, on October 18th. On October 16th, there will be representatives from Orsville Ford here to let us raise money for CTE clubs and classes by test driving Ford vehicles. You can have one person per household that's over the age of 18 come and drive for free, while also raising $20 for the club or program of your choosing. The event will be held in the front of the Magnolia campus from 3 to 6 p.m. on October 16th. Hey Blue Devils, just a quick reminder about photo makeup days. This Saturday the 13th, all seniors who did not take their senior photos can take them in the Magnolia Gym. It will be $10 for your sitting and you can include multiple outfits, backdrops, props, etc. If you just want to do the tux and drape photo, you can do that Monday during makeup pictures for everyone. Uh, freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, if you have not taken your picture, you need to come do that Monday in the Magnolia Gym. Thank you. Our Blue Devil fall athletes are really having an amazing season. Let's check in and see how the season is going, followed by some incredible highlights. I'm Sammy Humker. I'm on the Mooresville Cross Country team. Uh, the season's going pretty good so far. Our team's doing good. The boys have been winning a lot of their races. Um, varsity girls are working hard. Hey, my name is Damian Gonzalez, and I am part of the cross country team. Uh, so far, we've been doing pretty good. Uh, we've been chilling, cruising just one county. My name is Maddie Demers, and I'm part of the Mooresville golf team. And our season's going really good. We've won every single match. Hi, I'm Natalie. I am the two-time IMED conference champ. We had our conference tournament on Tuesday. We qualified all six for regionals, and hopefully Julie and I will win the regionals second year in a row. Alright guys, thanks for watching. And we have a Twitter, and we're having a contest. 
And you can win my love and affection if you go there, follow us, and sign up. No, we're going to have a much better prize, I promise. But definitely check it out at the Blue Devil Update. And the high school also has an Instagram page you guys should check out at Mooresville High School. The real prize is my love and affection. No. Welcome back, Miss Harris. We've got your back. Who is your favorite anchor, Emma or Ian? Definitely Ian. Emma. Emma. I'm going to have to go with Blake. Definitely Emma. Of course, you. Ian again! Ian! Yeah! Ian! Blake. Yeah, probably you, bro. Blake. Gage Welcher. Gage Welcher all the way.